Hello, and welcome to the last part of Frida's flower. We have, we need to make our etchings uh, around our blanket. But first of all, I thank you all for watching my reading. You and it has been my pleasure to help some of you, and also a uh, pleasure to. Starcraft for let me make this video and a big big thanks to Jane Crawford for that awesome patterns. Let us start. We need to join our yarn in the corner here of we need to start with the straight line here sides and we need to to start with a single crusade. As always, I start with a standing single crusade, but you can join your yarn, yarn as you prefer. And then we need to make 16 stitch here. I have counted a bit, and I think about two in every row will be 16. So one, two, only one in the top of this start because it's half and single crusade. So three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and 16, 16 stitches. And then we need to chain seven, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And skip our flower. So the chain need to lay back the flower. And then again, we need to make 16 stitches again. So one. Uh, if you don't like uh, this uh, space room, you can join. You know, when you make this, you have some chain three. You can join your yarn into that instead of go to the space room. So. Three, four, can be a little bit tight to do that, but it is possible, possible. if you now need two, four, four five, six. Seven eight nine and ten eleven twelve. And 17. I think I need to count one more time. Six, eight, yeah, 60. And then 
uh, we need to twenty one single here, and we need to. Uh, And we need to stitch in the corner here and make twenty one two. And now we need to do exactly the same for the next half hex. So 16 we need to have here 1, 2, 3, 4. Six and seven eight nine and ten. Eleven. Oops, and sixteen. Here, yeah, I need to count again. Sixteen, and then again, chain seven, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and now we need to make sixteen again here on the other side. So one, two. I will say this is only to show you. I will pull through when if when I make it 
at the right time I will try to put to join this each instead of the space so it will be tied to you can see here it's not so beautiful it's more I will like it more close to the edge so when I will f finish my work uh, in a time in the future I will make my joining in this chain space or uh, crochet, double crochet, DC um, instead of the space room so now we need to uh, make this finish this two, four, six, eight, ten, two, four, six, seven, eight, thirty, three more, one, two, and three. And now I need to read. Um, now we need to work at this zigzag edges, and then we need to we have the hook in the first of those three single crochet. And now we need to make single crochet in each of the next 18 stitches. So let's do. Uh, I want to. Three single together with join the next stitch here and skip this and join the next stitch on so you skip one single and make two single together but it count as a, a three single together and then we need to make um, 18 stitch again and do exactly the same as we did here so see you for the next round round 2 before I start I will tell you Maybe you need to uh, correct your stitch. Maybe you need to skip one or make two in one to make your count match the pattern. But now we need to take our new new yarn color puppy and we need to join to the zigzag each. We need to join our middle stitch of those three in the corner space. 
we join with a sync extending sync for sync. Uh, then we need to make um, uh, we need to make uh, a chain one and a single crochet and same same this then we need to chain one skip the next stitch and single crochet this we need to do nine times so that was one skip on two chain one three oops skip one three and four and five and six seven need to count one two three four five six seven eight to look this head on chain one skip two stitch simple in the sticks to the left side of the three together so I need to skip the skip one I need to just join the side you can see I have my stitch to skip so I just joined the stitch at the left side on my three together which is those stitches then we need to make chain one skip two stitches says and a single crochet in the next stitch which I do here skip two and single crochet in the next stitch chain one skip one stitch and single crochet in the next stitch and nine times so two three and four and five six seven nine times and then we need to the last one need to be in center which is correct you can see I have one two three so mine is in the center as the pattern says so far so good and then we need to um, um, make two more in this center and then you need to repeat this the four times for the H And then I'll see you again. Okay, as you can see, as I say, 
I haven't completed the whole pattern because I need to find out which color I can choose this color with because I have see I didn't have enough and I can get the same color again so I only have made a little piece to show you this itching but now we need to take the swim color and join your middle stitch at the corner again we, we crochet along the zigzag itches and when you have made your uh, middle stitch you need to chain one and make a single crochet in a chain one space and chain one and make single crochet in a chain one space that's for 90 times so we have two here and three oops three and four and five and six and seven and eight nine ten eleven twelve Look at this. As you can see, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighteen on the the um, red yarn and nineteen in the swim yarn, and then we need. And then we need to make uh, just look at this set. Yeah. Uh, chain one, skip one stitch, single into next chain one space. Ninety time, chain one, skip next stitch, and then you need to make three single crochet in the middle stitch of your tip here so it's just correct what I'm doing here so one two three and then again you need to chain one skip one and make single crochet in the next and so far so just repeat this and then I'll see you again For the last round with the black yarn, again joint the middle stitch of this chain corner space and we work again as the zigzag. Then you need to, to chain one and make single crochet in the next chain one space and this for nine times so one two three and four and five oops five and six and seven and eight and nine. 
nine. And then when you have do that, you need to make single crochet in the next two stitches. And then again chain one and a single crochet in the next chain one space nine times. So one two three four five and six and seven chain one eight and nine. And then you chain one, skip one, and make three single crochet in the middle of your chip here. So I think and, and that's what you need to repeat and when you are done you have the done pattern and you need to sew your in in and hope it makes so much sense for you because I didn't make the old pattern so but it's very beautiful thank you for watching my video and i hope you enjoyed it